about the backstory of Ghostbusters and you, and you say the supernatural was something that you grew up with. How did that happen? Well, my great-grandfather was a dentist in Kingston, Ontario. and uh, At the turn of the century, there were mediums and, and, and psychics. And my great-grandfather was the guy who kind of reviewed everybody that came through Kingston and said, well, this is genuine, that's a hoax. What so about I, you? I You've up. seen ghosts growing mm -hmm. up? No, no, I've never, never seen. Uh, I've heard uh, stuff in the old farmhouse. What would you hear? Uh, voices, footsteps, uh, uh, things, doors closing and opening. When I was a kid, you know, instead of, uh, you know, National Geographic lying around the old cottage there, it was the American Psychical Research Journals. I was reading one one afternoon and it talked about quantum physics and parapsychology and I thought, hey, why not do an old style ghost comedy like Bowery Boys, Abbott and Costello or Bob Hope, Bing Crosby, Ghost Breakers, Ghost Chasers and, and, and then use all of the vernacular and all of the technology that, that, that real Ghostbusters and real ghost hunters use, you know. And so uh, we were able to kind of marry the two into that, into that concept.